So we've got another image sent in for us to edit and as you can see we've got super warm tones, we've got these reds really popping and if you guys really like the style you can go give her a follow down in the description, all her links will be down there. So let's get into Lightroom and see if we can create an edit similar to this one here. As you can see we've got her image here from her Instagram and we've got the unedited image as well. So first step to making this image very warm is to bring up the warmth a lot. And then I'm just going to put a bit of a green tint in there as well. I think that helps a little. Uh, contrast up a little. Before I do anything else, I'm going to come down and just roughly take down our saturation. Might make it a little easier to do this. Highlights I'm going to bring down. Shadows up a lot. Blacks down. Cool. So I know to do that because there's not many shadows in the image, it's sort of bright and then gets dark very quickly. Clarity, quite a bit. Vibrance a little. Right, so tone curve, just going to do a simple S curve, bring up the shadows a little, maybe bring down the highlights a tad. Okay, so moving on, and I might just take down these yellows, and we'll start working with some hues. Actually, before hues, I'm going to do some luminance because I think the luminance is really going to make a big impact on this image. We're looking quite dark at the moment, so I think bringing up things like the yellows is going to really make a big difference. You can just keep these oranges down a little for those skin tones. Going back to our hues, just trying to match them up best we can. And these yellows, I mean these greens, are looking pretty warm. Saturation. These greens bring them down a lot. Blues, maybe just a tad. Looking pretty close, do some sharpening. And I'm pretty happy with that.
Gonna just sharpen her face a little. So contrast is a good thing to bring up as it will make the face pop a bit more. Some sharpening. And I'm just going to leave it there guys, you guys might see a bit of a difference, I'll probably notice something later, but I'm just going to leave it there, I think you guys get the point pretty close now. And yeah, I like how it's kind of got that wedding kind of vibe, I think a few people go for this sort of look for weddings, really warm. And yeah, you guys can go give her a follow down in the description, you can give myself a follow, and yeah, I really want to help you guys, and yeah, so I'm going to try to get better at explaining exactly what I'm doing and yeah so you can check out my presets if you are really after those and leave a comment on who you guys want to see and i'll catch you in the next one